I'd like to thank Landon for inviting me to this week's round robin. The question being, what would I say to get you to vote for me? Well, friends, Americans, fellow citizens, listen and believe. I come to bury America, not to praise it. The evil that her politicians do lives after them, while the good is interred with uncast votes. And so be it with America. The 1% has sold you that the poor just aren't ambitious, untrue, slave wages, corporate welfare, not laziness, are at grievous fault. And grievously will our taxpayers pay for it here under watch of the 1% and their ilk. For the 1% are ethical capitalists. They all are. All ethical capitalists. Yes, I'm here to speak at America's funeral. She was our dream, killed on Wall Street. But the 1% say racial discrimination is the pestilence. And the 1% are ethical businessmen. They've brought many criminals to heel. I wonder whose coffers those prisons fill. Does this in America seem judicious? And where our soldiers have died, politicians have slept. The 1% should be made of sterner stuff. But the 1% say they're not greedy or ambitious, and the 1% are ethical corporate men. You all did see in the courts when the corporations thrice presented Citizens United, which the courts only twice refused. Was that ambition? Because the 1% say they're not ambitious. <laughs> sure, the 1% are just like the common man. Listen. I speak not to disprove what the wealthy tell you, but rather to talk about what I do know. You all believed in the American dream once, rightly. So what spin doctors now convince you to continue voting for the 1%? Oh, America, you have been duped by corporate greed, and our citizens have lost their passion. Bear with me. Our dreams are there in the coffin with America until we no longer pause from acting in our democracy. Code SD 2016. Peace out.